Faye Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw plant parts that we eat. So I'm going to write plant parts we eat. And I'm putting a happy face because we all should eat our vegetables. Okay, starting way over here on the left, I'm going to put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a curve line up, big curve line down, curve line up, and curve line out. I come back to my dot, and I'm going to draw it again. Curve line in, curve line out, curve line up, little curve line connect. I come right here at the top, and I'm just going to draw a wavy, wavy line across and connect. I come inside and I'm just going to draw a wavy line, wavy line, wavy line, wavy line, wavy line, keep going, wavy line. Once I've done that, I come back in and I just draw little wavy lines going perpendicular or up and down to the first wavy lines that I drew. Now this part of the plant is or are the seeds. And what plant is this? This is corn. C-O-R-N. Each one of those little kernels is a seed. If you took them you could go and grow more corn. Okay, the next part that we're going to talk about is the root. Now these are all different plants that exemplify or give you an example of each of the plant parts. This is for a root. I come up to the top and I put a dot. From that dot I draw a little curved line. Come back to the dot and draw a straight diagonal down, straight diagonal up, connect. I'm going to come back to my dot and draw a little curved line over and across. I draw a straight diagonal out on the left, wavy, wavy, wavy line, connect. Straight diagonal up, wavy, wavy, wavy line, connect. Going across the inside, I just put little straight lines. And what is this? This is a carrot. C A R R. OT, which is the root of the plant. Okay, right next door to that, I'm going to put a dot, and from that dot, I'm going to draw a straight line, curve line, straight line up, and leave it floating. Come back in on the left and just draw a straight line down on the left, straight line down on the right, straight line down in the middle. Come up to the very top and just do some wavy, wavy, wavy line connect. Wavy, wavy, wavy line connect. Wavy, wavy, wavy line connect. This is the stem of a plant. And it's the part that we eat is celery. Okay? Now, the next section, just put a dot right here in the middle. And we're just going to go wavy, wavy, wavy line to the dot. Come up a little. Wavy, wavy, wavy line all the way around. Wavy, wavy, connect. Wavy, wavy, connect. Wavy, wavy, connect. If you have room, you could even draw a bigger wavy line. Wavy line and a wavy line. Okay. What are these? These are leaves, and the leaves that we eat is from lettuce. Okay, now I come over here to the last part, put a dot, and I'm going to draw a curve line, curve line, curve line, connect, curve line out on the left, 
curve line out on the right, little curve line connect. Come down a little ways if you have room, put a dot, wavy, 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 wavy line, curve line out on the left, curve line out on the right, little curve line connect. Come back, let's put one more, wavy, 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 wavy line, curve line out on the left, curve line out on the right, little curve line connect. These are the flowers of a plant, but what we eat is broccoli. And I'm gonna come back in and just add some squiggles on the inside. So, they're not all the same plant, but they do give you examples of what parts we do eat. So for corn, it's seeds. Carrots are roots. Celery are stems. Lettuce are leaves. Broccoli are flowers. All of these are plant parts that we eat. Okay, let's see how we're gonna color these in. Okay, first one, pretty easy. Let's make our corn all yellow. And I always like saying, oh, I'm gonna to go to the movies and have a bag of seeds. Because what I'm really saying is I'm gonna have a bag of popcorn, because these seeds can be popped into popcorn. So first I do the yellow, then I do a line of light green, a line of light green, and then a couple of lines of dark green to fill in the outside. You're gonna do a little bit of double coloring on this one, okay? Then I move over to carrot. I do my top part green. I do the little head part brown. And then I do the bulk of my carrot orange, okay? Now I come over to my stem and I'm gonna do light green lines for my celery, my stem come up and put some light green. And then I'm just gonna add a little tiny bit of green, dark green, for a double color. You don't really have to color all of these all the way in, just lines will do it. Okay, now I move over to my leaves, and here's my lettuce, and I found two colors of green that I hadn't used, so whatever this green is, I think it's sea foam, I used that one. And then I came back in and I did my regular green. If you don't have some different color greens, just know that you can get the effect by just using your regular green, pressing dark and pressing light, okay? And then finally my broccoli, which is just regular green, okay? Now, you can probably think up other plant parts that we eat and put them in place of what I've done it's all up to you. You are not only the artist, you are the botanist, the person who studies plants. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here are my plant parts that we eat. You can make up your own chart or use this one. It's up to you. Okay, bye-bye.